What's up guys, um, basically what I'm going to do is show you how to make a budget, and this is, this should work. I'm not the best with Excel, I'm definitely not the best, but I can give you the basic idea of what to do. So I'm going to put in column A1, I'm going to put bills, and those are just going to be a list of our bills. Um, and we're going to put how much the bills, you know. We'll just say cost, even though cost is not right. Bills, all right. So mortgage, rent, that'll be number one. Car payment. And obviously, this is going to change with each person because you're going to have different bills than I will. Wow. And this doesn't want to work, does it? All right. Now it does. That's better. All right. So bills, cost. Actually, let's go ahead and put price. Price of the bills, that makes sense, right? Alright. Let's, uh, let's annoy these. Alright, so rent, car payment, cable, um, insurance. Uh, what else do you do? Gym, maybe. Uh, I don't know. Cell phone. Everyone's got one of those these days. Cell phone. Let's think of what else you got. I mean, you're probably filling this out a lot faster than me. I don't have a whole lot of bills, I guess. Um, insurance, rent, car payment. Uh, you definitely got to put in your food cost, um, gas expenses. All right, so that's going to be the basic one. Now, I'll go ahead and fill this in now. I'm going to put, uh, I don't know. 1200 for rent, car payment is 550, cable, what is that, like 150, insurance, 350, gym, I think gym's like 45 a month, cell phone, uh, I don't know what that is, I think it's like 100 bucks, food, food was, uh, I'd say just for me, well if it costs you money, if you're paying for your whole family then write it in, but for me, I would say like 250 a month. This is monthly. Gas expenses probably somewhere around 200 a month. Okay. So now this is the part I'm worried about that I can't remember. I don't know if I do this. Yeah, I can't remember exactly how this. Alright, let me see if I can figure out how to sum this up. Auto sum. There we go. That's pretty pretty easy, just hit that. <laughs> sorry guys, it's been a long time since I took an Excel class. Um, sorry. Right. The bills, we have 2845 a month. Now of course, we need to start putting together some other things. Income. So, I'm just going to put a money sign here. Let's say job. Let's say your job pays you, I don't know, 40, 200 a month. I don't know how much your job pays you. We can also do this. I believe there's a way to convert this into dollars. There we go. Alright, job. Um, I don't know. Maybe you give plasma. Maybe that's like... <laughs> 260 a month. Um, what are some other ways of making money? Uh, baby, I'm just gonna put random stuff. If you have more ways of making money, that's cool. How much is babysitting? Like five dollars an hour or something? Let's call that an extra hundred a month. All right, so let's take that auto summit, put it into money. Let's see how much money. Why are you doing this? Okay. Leftover money. Now, let me see if I can figure this out. It would be B10. Wait, equals B10. 
D10, no, 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 no. Uh, D5, D5 minus B10. Okay, so you're left with $1,715 left a month, which isn't bad, right? I mean, you can live off that, spare money. So, basically that's a budget. I mean, obviously your bills are going to be different than mine. Your income is going to be different. Obviously this is not my income. Uh, I don't babysit. I don't give plasma. I, I want to give plasma. I always say I'm going to. I just never do it. Um, every time I think about getting poked with a needle, I, I always tend to avoid it. But anyways, um, this is just a basic budget. Um, there's some other aspects to the budget we're not going to cover this time. We can get into a more detailed budget, what to do with the leftover money, that sort of thing, um, in a later video. But for right now, thanks for watching, and please subscribe.